everyone. This is Cheryl with you here today and I have had several questions regarding how to replace the elastic in a Foxy Fix notebook. So I have a Foxy Fix elastic replacement kit and I will walk you through it. It comes in this cute little tin and I am a big fan of the mint elastic. So that is what I ordered, although they will have several other colors. But in here you're going to find your elastic. You're going to find a needle to help you thread the elastic through the holes. And there's also a little instruction sheet. First thing you need to do is obviously remove the old elastic. The center one is really easy. You just pull it right through the hole. The other bands, which is on the, which holds your notebooks, those have a small little knot holding all four of them in place. And you can either try to untie the knot or if you have trouble with that, you can just clip it. I don't want to just clip it. I like to um, save things, but this is still going to be plenty usable to be used again. And then you're just going to pull it through all the holes and remove it. And as you're removing it, take a quick look to see how they're threaded through. This will help you to re-thread. Just like regular th um, thread, having a frayed end sometimes makes it hard to get it clipped in. So I just trimmed the teeny tiny little piece off so that it wouldn't be frayed. And then I'm going to clip the elastic into the needle. We're going to start on the inside of the folder. You're going to pull the elastic through and then back through the outside. You'll bring it straight down into the bottom hole. Back into the middle. Pull them snug, but don't pull them so snug that it pulls on the folder. This is the Sandstorm folder, so it's a little bit thicker than some of the thinner leathers, but you don't want it to be folded, or to bend, I should say, in place. And now we're gonna go right back down this center. Make sure that everything looks even and looks right. And then because I want some extra elastic, I'm going to make sure that when I cut the pieces, I have the least amount of waste.
There we go. Everything looks good. I'm going to tie the knot down here. So, so again, I have the least amount of waste. And you want it to be snug. Then you just trim off the edges. And those are the inside elastics. Now, this piece that I have, they actually include another piece for you to, for the band that goes around, but I have enough on here that I am, I think I can actually use this to, yeah, should be plenty big enough. And then this goes back down through. What you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna close it, use the elastic to see how much you need, and then pull that until that is also snug. And once you have it where you want it, you're gonna tie a knot in this one too. In fact, we can take the little needle off of it now. And you can, um, Cut that as close as you want, and there we go. Instead of beige, I now have the mint green. I hope that helps, thank you.